I'm so excited to go home. Hello, this week is my final week, which means next week is spring break, which also means I will finally get to travel home. I just finished my first final. So for dinner, I got a burger and fries and a drink from our barn. So this time I'm gonna take you guys to see what it's like traveling alone to get back home. I've already started packing my luggage because I want to start like bringing stuff back. So it's like easier doing move out. Come along with me. Traveling alone is kind of scary, but it's also therapeutic. I finished another final, so I went to go get lunch from the hub, and I picked up this rice bowl with chicken from the Halal Shack. It was so good. Hi, so I just finished taking a midterm. I'm going home tomorrow. I'm so excited to go home. I'll be heading to the airport right after I finish my last midterm tomorrow, so I'm going to finally finish packing right now. I kind of just like threw everything in here, so now I need to organize it. I finished packing. I tried to take back some stuff so that it's like easier for when I'm moving out. Yay! Of course, I gotta safely pack away my stuffed animals for a safe trip back. <laughs> I was walking over to my friend's car because he was driving me to drop me off at the airport. So when I enter the airport, it's, Ontario Airport is a pretty small airport, so right away I head over to the southwest area and I go into one of the kiosks to check myself in. I like printing out my boarding pass just in case, and then I also have to tag my check-in luggage. Then I just take the escalators upstairs directly to TSA. I got the security check and I have to put all my like, things back in my backpack that I take out. Of course, I always use the bathroom first before I go and find my gate. And I passed by all like the food options. I got there pretty early this time so like it wasn't packed at the gate like usual so I just found a seat to sit down and wait. This is me just waiting at my gate. I was pretty bored because there was like a 20 minute delay for my flight. I also do get pretty nervous when I'm flying. But our plane finally came, and then I saw the car with all our luggages. Hi guys, welcome! There's no assigned seats, so you just walk until you see empty space, or just the seat wherever you want to. I always like picking the window seats. Here's the view. I'm not that tall, so I definitely get plenty of leg room. Masks aren't required anymore, but I still like wearing one, just in case. So I'll be flying from Ontario Airport to San Jose Airport, and usually this only takes about a 50 minute flight. Like there isn't much time that we spend up at 10,000 feet in the air before we start getting ready to land again. I feel like prior to college, I would have never imagined having to travel alone this much, but it's always exciting to go home. I'm also traveling between smaller airports, so it's pretty peaceful. It's not that hectic because it's not like the big ones where there's lots of terminals. All I need is to make sure that I have my ID with me. I will say though, it is nicer to be able to match up flights with a friend so that we'd be able to travel together. This 
snow looks so pretty on the mountain. Southwest does provide complimentary snack and drinks on this flight. Inside the bag is like a trail mix. I usually don't eat it on the flight because I feel like my hands aren't clean. And then I asked for some cranberry juice. I've arrived in San Jose. I'm so happy to be home. I'm just taking the escalator down to go to baggage claim and then once I've gotten my luggage I usually go wait outside for my dad to come pick me up. And there's always people that crowd very close to get their luggage right away. I had a flight. I saw the a lot of people doing the I had not eaten all day because I usually don't eat before flight and also I had my final. I was starving by the time I got home. Then I went out with my boyfriend because I hadn't seen him in three months. Hello everyone, so I am finally home. I'm so excited to be home. And yeah, that was my trip. That was my solo trip flying back home from Riverside. Bye!